part of the reason I'm at Six Sense um, is I had uh, worked at a couple gigantic software organizations, um, uh, Microsoft, Oracle before that, um, enjoyed both, but kind of knew I wanted to get back to a smaller organization. And so I reached out to the CEO of Sixth Sense, who I'd worked with 25 years ago, um, but had for the most part lost touch with. Um, and uh, this was right before Thanksgiving, I guess it would have been 2021. We went for lunch and kind of the first thing he said to me um, was, you know, I just remember you being a showman. And what he meant by that was back when we worked together during the dot-com boom and, and even part of the bust um, was in addition to being a sales engineer and doing demos, um, I also tended to MC um, the big sales kickoffs that we did, which often involved like producing songs for the vice president of worldwide sales who wanted his team to lip sync them, sometimes skits, um, you know, anything just to make these like three day ordeals fun, engaging, keep the audience kind of on the edge of their seat type of thing. Um, and obviously like I was capable of doing a really good demo, otherwise the conversation would have ended there. Um, but not everybody sort of has that desire to want to be on a big stage in front of everybody. I mean, I was joking, I wasn't joking when I said before this started that I'm nervous. I still get nervous every time I present or, you know, or do a big speech or even something like this. Um, hopefully I figured out how to contain it so the audience can't tell, but it doesn't mean it's, it's not there. Um, and so kind of over the course of the lunch, it was, well, let's see if we can figure out how to carve out a role for you at Sixth Sense. We don't really have someone that has my particular skill set. Um, I loved the idea. I was in very, I was in deep in conversations with other companies um, that I was looking at, but I just, I couldn't resist the opportunity to sort of see where that would take me. Um, and so it's now been about a year and a half. Um, I've done a, a number of, of wild different things that probably most people don't get to do in their day jobs. Um, and I'm about to kick off another one here in a couple of weeks with an executive lunch for sales leaders.